boxes this month. Two. I'm so excited to dig through them. Hey guys, I'm Kristen with IcyStarsQuilting.com. Yeah, I added a few new things to my office, which started out as a cleaning project and then morphed into what else can I do to make a bigger mess before I clean all this stuff up? <laughs> Which is kind of how things roll. Anyways, but I got something really, really fun in the mail and it came like super quick. So I had to tell you, you know, I love Creative Notions. I'm not shy about that company. I love them, right? I love them. And, and not to sound like a broken record here, but because of the shipping delays and everything that happened, blah, 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 blah. I know we're all tired of hearing that excuse, but it's the world we live in right now. And because of that, they've been behind on their boxes. And I know that Vicki at Creative Notions has been doing the best that she can to go ahead and get those boxes out as quick as possible so that they do remain somewhat on a, a schedule, right? Well, I got two boxes this month. Two. I'm so excited to dig through them. So if you're new to my channel and you somehow made it through all of that rambling, hi, I'm Kristen with IcyStarsQuilting.com. I share lots of tips and tricks to make your life as a modern quilter easier. So if you are not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. You're going to love all of the fun things that I share because yeah, I like to have fun. I do, I love to have fun. So if you are already a subscriber and it says subscribed there, hey, we're besties right now, I love it. So let's go through this beautiful Creative Notions bag. I'm gonna show you the first bag, okay? So we got a beautiful 2023 calendar. Now, it's April. I'm gonna miss a couple months out of this calendar, which is a little sad. What are you gonna do, right? So this calendar is lovely very nice colorful printed it even has like this right here has all of the uh, quilting abbreviations and stuff on it so and it has like diagrams and things on it to help you as well i love them look how beautiful these pictures are all right let's get to the good stuff okay these bags are super useful i love that their packaging is reusable I like to use these for gifts when I have, um, you know, birthdays come up or whatever because we can reuse these. What I'm pulling out here is, um, we'll get to the paper in a minute. Um, so I have a slap band cushion. Where are my girls at who used to wear as many slap bracelets on their wrists as they can and they loved to go around and smack their siblings <laughs> to get them to wear a bracelet. So this is the slap bracelet pin cushion is that what they called it slap band pen cushion all right so it's like this bam and you have a little pin cushion it's actually relatively light as well and i like that about it so it fits nicely it would fit better if i didn't have my watch on at the moment but if it's nicely you can put your pens and you don't have to you know you hands free so that's really fun we have some fabric in here. Digging through here again, I have some fabric. Let's see. Creative Notions always sends snacks. Gotta love those. Actually, these are like my most favorite cookie ever. If you have not had these cookies, go to the store, get them. Thanks, Vicky. Okay, so this is actually the December 2022 bag. I told you, a little bit behind. We're catching up though, we're catching up. I can feel it. And we've got another one right over here that we're gonna go through in just a minute as well. So this is the December one. And we have blissful feelings. Lots of wonderful things are in this bag. Total value is $87 for this. We have lots of stuff, all right? This is the winter garden quilt pattern. Look how pretty that is. And what I love about this is look at this fabric does it look familiar yeah we see it right here in the pattern so visual learners this is what you need visual people you want to see what it looks like here's your fabric to go with it bam just like that and here are the ruler templates that were mentioned here they are we have a six inch circle see it perfectly nice clear good quality acrylic template and we have a five inch circle good quality acrylic template the same these are going to i actually don't have circle templates i don't have circle templates we got a um delicious recipe for hawaiian haystacks every single month 
Creative Notions also has reader submitted recipes that go into the bag so it makes it a little bit more personal. And then as mentioned, we have two zipper bags that we got which are really, really good for keeping your rulers nice and safe and together so they don't get scratched. All right, let's go a little bit further into the bag, see what else we got. I love this fabric. I mean, can you see like, look how beautiful those colors are. You get some nice greens, some nice blues in there. This is really pretty. Okay, and then the other patterns, because there's always some block of the month patterns included as well, is the butterfly right there. See how beautiful that is? And ooh, look at this. <gasps> this is beautiful. Do you see this? Do you see how pretty it is? So this is the Garden Bloom quilt pattern, and I love this so each of these blocks are gorgeous and then the butterfly table topper pattern is right here now if you saw this pattern and you thought no way am i making that no no too too hard for me right option number two right a table topper this table topper 24 inch by 24 inch can you do this you absolutely can because Creative Notions gives you step-by-step -step directions every single page so you can follow them and make it yourself. Pretty cool, huh? Okay, moving on to the next bag that I have. Ta-da! See? Yes, I was so excited to get two of these because one, it means that they're getting back on track and on schedule, and two, I get presents twice this month, and I have not looked in here again, so you are getting exactly the view that I am getting. If you are one of those people who like go for the card first instead of like going straight to the gift, that's that's what I'm trying to do right now. And I found it, the paper that shows everything that is in this box. So this is the January 2023 one, yay! We are in January on the Creative Notion subscription boxes. It's coming, we're gonna be caught up pretty soon. I can feel it. This is amazing. Good job, Creative Notion. Good, good job. Theme for this one is Indigo Splash. And let's see, the total value is $82.99. I mean, for what you pay for this, the value in this is amazing. So here's the contents of the bag for this month. That's a lot of stuff. That's a lot of stuff. Okay, now I can go in and dig for things. Okay, um, rotary blades. Also, a nice little case to keep them in. See that? That is nice. That's the perfect size case to keep either your brand new rotary blades in or old rotary blades because believe me, you don't want to accidentally, you know, try and grab one of these from the wrong side. Don't ask me how I know. Um, here is the Taylor's Clapper. Have you used one of these before? It's called a Taylor's Clapper. And these things get your seams the flattest you will ever, ever see them. I'll have to do a video sometime using one of these because I do use one in my quilt room, but I don't often show that in the video because I don't know, I just forget, right? So this one is actually, um, it looks like it's owned by a small family business making beautiful handcrafted tools to aid in your quilting and sewing needs. And that's pretty cool. I love that Creative Notions also supports the little guys, right? We gotta support the little guys. And um, so this, what you do is you would iron your seam and then you put this on it to add some extra weight to it, especially if you have like a really thick seam or a stubborn seam, right? Put this on top of it after you get done ironing it while it's still warm. And as it cools, this just makes sure nothing moves. Nothing goes anywhere. It gets things really nice and flat because it does have some good weight to it. Okay, let's see what else we got. They keep keeping my snack drawer full. I love this. Thank you for more treats to go in the sewing room. This is the Blue Mountain Quilt and Table Runner. Look at this pattern. Isn't that beautiful? It's one of those patterns that like looks kind of complicated, but once you break it down, it's not that hard and you can do this, I swear. You can do this. There is also an option for the table runner on the back, which looks like this. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. I love the contrast of the light and the dark and how it does that kind of ripple thing throughout there. That's really beautiful. This is a really, really fun pattern. If you didn't get it when I showed earlier with the other box, 
Look at the blue indigo fabric that we have. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, there's something else in here. Oh, we have some snips. Yay. And these are cute. They're like bright purple. I love these. These are really cute. These are also a really fun tool for the sewing room. Um, they, they stay open. So the motion that you use for your fingers when you're using tiny scissors or like embroidery scissors or whatever, it basically cuts your motion in half because these stay open. So these stay open, right? Can you see that right there? So if I push down and I open, I let go, closed, and then I let go, they open. So instead of like a regular pair of scissors, you have to close down and then open up again and close down and open up again. This cuts your motion in half. It doesn't seem like a lot, but trust me, when you do a lot of sewing and you do a lot of quilting and you have to snip those tiny little seams over and over again, these are pretty awesome. And let's look at this fabric again because I love these blue hues. Aren't those pretty? Oh man. This one especially, I love that. Um, Moda has a fabric that I bought at QuiltCon. I believe I bought it at QuiltCon that looks very similar to this one right here and I love it. It's so, so pretty. It just has this like um, free, happy vibe to it, which is, you know, that's how I roll. So there you have it, the beautiful fabrics to it. And I believe there's a couple more things down in here for me to show you. Another reader submitted recipe. This one is for tea donuts. Looks delicious. And then we have a couple more patterns as well. So we have this one that is a block of the month. Very beautiful, um, simple, but effective quilt block. Okay, look how lovely that is, right? That's kind of your just good classic quilt block that is going to make a gorgeous, gorgeous quilt. And then we also got this pattern right here, which has the same fabrics from the kit this month. Isn't it beautiful, right? Look how pretty this is. Absolutely gorgeous. And you can use this pattern to make these blocks. And again, details, detailed instructions extra ideas to use the subscribers competition block. So look how pretty that is. I get inspiration every single month from these. I'll admit sometimes it's like I have too much inspiration, but I would rather have too much than not enough because I always come back to these. And I believe I showed you last month, I showed you the binder where I keep all of my patterns that come from Creative Notions. So whenever I want to make something, but I don't want to do all the research for it beforehand, I go back to those pattern books and I look through and I find exactly what I want, right? I love them for that because you need that constant source of inspiration. So if you're looking for a really good subscriber box to get into and get some quilting tools, get some fabric, get some fun ideas, this one has it all. I'm gonna go ahead and put the link to Creative Notions in the description box down below, as well as their YouTube channel. Make sure you go check out their YouTube channel. They have lots of tutorials on there as well as um, more ideas more things that they're sharing and they're doing really, really amazing things over at that company. Thanks for watching this video. If you wanna see more content like this, make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit the like button, pretty please. That helps me out a lot and I look forward to seeing all the comments and things that you leave down below. Tell me what your favorite subscription box is and what it is that you like to get in the mail. I would love to know because at IC Stars Quilting, we send out some happy mail every once in a while and I think I'm feeling like it's time to do it again. So if you would like some happy mail from me, make sure that you're on my email list and we'll be in touch soon. Have a wonderful day. I'll talk to you soon. I'm Kristen with icstarsquilting.com. Bye.